All right, today we're gonna talk about five reasons why you should carry a fixed blade knife. You know, there's kind of a stigma about carrying fixed blades. You know, you got this big heavy knife, it's hanging off your side, it's big, you look like Crocodile Dundee. Uh, but we've broken the mold on that, I think, at Montana Knife Company, and we've got some reasons why we feel it's important for certain people, especially, to carry a fixed blade knife. First of all, fixed blade knives are actually more durable and stronger. So if you're a person that's got a day job where you're doing a lot of maybe opening boxes, you're doing a lot of work, you're an electrician, you're a lineman, you're somebody that's doing heavy work and you need to put a knife to a test, you know, we see a lot of people going through cheap folders like crazy. In my opinion, you should just buy one good knife and carry that, keep it sharp, and use that in your daily tasks. Um, we talk about weight a lot of times at Montana Knife Company, especially in a hunting situation where you're packing, you know, a bunch of gear to the top of a mountain. But weight's important when you're just carrying knives around during the day or you're carrying really anything, a backpack on the bus. You know, you're always thinking about weight and we don't want things that are big and bulky. And that's where our mini goat, we actually have a pocket clip on that carries in your pocket, only weighs one ounce. Uh, that's really a pocket full of change weighs more than an ounce. Uh, the mini goat is par it's got paracord on it, so that knife is actually uh, really handy if you need to take that cord off and tie something up, uh, have a little bit of rope on you. Um, but weight in almost all of our knives is way less of a consideration than it is with a lot of other knife companies out there. All right, the second reason why is accessibility. All right, a lot of people have a folding knife in their pocket. Okay, well, it depends on what you're using that knife for, uh, but in your pocket's fine, except what if you're in a situation at work that somebody's hung up, they're in a bad situation, and you need to pull a knife out quickly and react and cut something free. You know, we see this a lot with people who are like crab fishermen, for example. They're throwing pots over the side of a boat, and people get hung up in a rope, and that rope starts to get tight and starts, wants to drag them off of a boat. Now, obviously, not everybody's a crab fisherman, but there's a lot of jobs out there where we find people actually use their knives in a bind, maybe riding horses, uh, doing that kind of stuff. We actually had a person in the backcountry in the Bob Marshall Wilderness save one of their friends by cutting the saddle off of a person uh, that a, a horse had rolled over on, and they had to get the cinch cut free from, for that person. Um, hikers, bikers, there's a lot of different situations where you want a knife accessible. Self-defense is our third reason why you should absolutely carry a fixed blade knife. You know, in this crazy world today with people and, and what's happening a lot of times in our big cities, I think self-defense has become more and more on the forefront of people's minds. Um, you know, there's a lot of really bad evil, frankly, in this world going on right now. And I'm personally someone who's got a daughter who's leaving for college this fall. You know, she's gonna be going out on hikes. She's gonna be walking to her car alone. She's gonna be jogging. Um, and, and again, we think we have knives that can really help in those situations. You know, our speed goat, our mini goat, those can clip onto leggings or a sports bra or in a man's pocket. You know, if you're walking to your car, you're riding the subway, you're going to work, uh, we really feel like that fixed blade is a much better self-defense tool um, than a folding pocket knife that's in your pocket. Um, that accessibility piece in a self-defense situation where you have to react fast is critically important with a knife. Um, I can't emphasize enough uh, the, the self-defense portion, and there's a lot of places in this country where you're not allowed to carry a pistol, quite frankly. Carrying a can of mace or bear spray is big and bulky. You know, you're not walking around with a baseball bat or a taser. You know, you're a professional, and that's where we have a new knife coming out with Fieldcraft Survival. Uh, that by the time you watch this video, you'll probably see this. It's a concealed carry knife that's inside your waistband under your t-shirt. Um, so again, the self-defense piece is really important, especially if you have a wife or a daughter uh, with the stuff that's happening with sex trafficking and everything else. Please carry a fixed blade knife if, you're, if you live in a situation where you think you might have uh, issues with, with creeps, frankly. Okay, the fourth reason for a fixed blade knife is reliability. Uh, there's not a bunch of working parts to a fixed blade. It kind of is what it is. We keep our knives simple for a reason. It's not a bunch of bells and whistles. I want solid construction. 
uh, that just works. You know, with a fixed blade knife, you have pivots, you have bearings, you have detents, you have back bars, liners, locks, all these different scenarios of different things that can go wrong with your knife. Um, again, especially if you're someone who's using a knife hard, a fixed blade knife is, is, is great for that situation. Um, there's a lot of jobs that people have that when they're using these pocket knives, you're putting a lot of side pressure on that knife. You know, like even it ripping open boxes, unless you're pulling in a perfectly straight line, if you've got side tension on that knife or you need to pry anything or scrape, all that side tension on a folder is putting pressure on the pivot area of a, of a folding knife. The mechanism of a folder is not made for side to side load. It's made for more of a cutting action. Uh, so a fixed blade knife obviously is more designed, especially in a full tang construction, which all of our knives are. Full tang construction knife, you can be very, uh, uh, sure that you can rely on that knife. And that leads into our last point, which is the low maintenance portion of a fixed blade knife. All you have to do is sharpen that blade, especially with our Magna Cut knives, you know, with the stainless steel, you don't even have to worry about the blade wax and keeping those knives as clean. Um, with our fixed blade knives, obviously in our, in our carbon steel line with our 52 and 100, a little bit of blade wax on that, and that's basically all the maintenance you need to do. It's always just on your belt. Uh, we encourage people, like if you're carrying a knife, say in a backpack situation, uh, going to the office, or you're a student, you can clip that knife right on your backpack strap, and you literally don't have to worry about it. With a folding knife, you know, a lot of women are wearing dresses, skirts, leggings. There's a lot of places that they can't put a folding knife on their body where with a fixed blade knife, they can clip it on their backpack, on their laptop strap. They can clip it inside their leggings, you know, inside of a sports bra. There's a lot of places to carry a fixed blade knife that you just can't put, uh, you know, a, a folding knife or a pocket knife. Pocket knives tend to get lost a lot. You leave them in a pair of jeans. With a fixed blade knife, with our sheath systems, you clip it on, it's kind of a clip it and forget it situation, so. That's five reasons why you should carry a fixed blade knife. Uh, folders are great. We're gonna be working on developing our own. We wanna have folding knives, um, but I do think there's a lot of reasons why you should be carrying a fixed blade knife, and frankly, a lot of people just don't think of those. So, are you a person that walks to work? Are you a person that commutes, walks to your car late at night, uh, leaves a job late at night? Um, are you a woman who goes on hikes or jogs, or, or a man as well? Um, you know, I, I think a lot of these reasons are reasons why you should be carrying a fixed blade knife.